Welcome back to my channel. My name is Mocha Sister. I am a creator, writer, publisher, and sometimes I come on here and talk about whatever is going on. As you know, if, unless you're living under a rock, I am going to be traveling for the first time in four years. And um, before we get into the video, please subscribe to the channel. To everybody else, welcome back. Welcome back to my channel. So what the page that you're looking at behind me is basically the TSA rules. Um, I downloaded the TSA um, app and it tells you what you can bring on as a carry on and what you have to get checked in. Most people don't do that. If you want to reduce your stress when you, before you get to the airport, download the app or look at this page on tsa.gov and Google, what can I bring TSA? Um, and it's great because for me, I know the rules basically are, if it's liquid, it has to be less than 3.4 ounces. But there are things that you can bring that I didn't think about or know. Yes, you can bring stuff like books, a bottle opener. But if you going on and you're drinking your water, you have to toss it because most bottles of water is like, eight ounce or more. So it has to be less than three ounces, but you can bring on some interesting things, you know, boxing gloves, um, bread, you can bring cooked meat, which I did not know. Um, bug repellent, but it has to be under a certain amount, like 3.4 ounce. So if you're going to the islands and you want to bring that, get the sound, get the travel version of it. A lot of people like where I'm going, it's going to be warm. And if you bringing the big thing, a bottle, you just going to have to toss that. Um, of course, you can bring, you know, candy, you can bring cookies. They're not supposed to get rid of that. But if you have canned goods or canned foods, it will have to go and be checked. Your bag must be checked for that. So if you go through that list, it's, it will save your life. I'm going to tell you right now, I regret not getting my TSA, pre-TSA, um, Thing completed before this trip because I want to just go straight through the line. But uh, I'm glad I did download the actual app. So I'm going to go through everything to make sure my bag is tight and hopefully I can go through without any issues um, because I'm not bringing, I'm not going to allow them to like take my stuff. I remember one year I uh, had just bought this big thing, a shower gel. And it was right when something happened and um, they started like tearing down and telling people, sorry, they took that whole bottle. It was a brand new bottle that I had not even used and they tossed it. That's the only way I got through the line. They had to take it. And don't be like me. Go to this website before you travel, especially if you're going to go on a cruise or something like that. And also to touch upon the pre pre-check TSA, it costs like $85 for five years. It gets you through the line a lot quicker. I'm going to have to do it after this trip. But anyway, I'll talk to you guys soon. Let me know. Did you know about the TSA app and have you ever gone through straight without any issues with your carry-on? Talk to you soon. Welcome back to my